Joassé, ta lagoda, c'est merger que tu es fait. Il t'a lagoda avec papa qui t'a fait. Tion. Voilà, Tion. Est-ce que vous pouvez vous faire Mais Tion. So, papa, j'ai fait lagoda, lui, t'es fait merger. Gandhi, lagoda, fait petit lagoda, mais t'es fait petit, mais j'ai. Sous quoi moi, il des tontons. Est-ce que vous avez fait des tontons Il y a des petits tontons. Ok. Donc, so, qui est-ce que vous avez fait des petits tontons Qui a fait des petits tontons Il a fait des yéyé. Il a fait des djévé. Il a fait des tontifons. Il a fait des tontinons. Il a fait des joacinis. Il a fait des. Il était maman, madame Rigo, c'était Itilia. Si on était tout petit, ça, on parlait de joie seulement. Mais pas oublier que joie c'est lui-même. Il était frère, il était saint tout. Il était maman Christophe aussi. Madame la voix, il mène lui-même. Il mène. Mais, comme on dit, nous, joie, il était frère, il était soeur aussi. Et. Tout le monde sait que c'est la bonne âme. Une seule joie, que moi, je suis venu en 1902, 1903. Une seule joie, qui c'était Madame Ilofer, c'est l'autre jour de la vie. Vous pouvez imaginer, il y a un monde qui a été fait un petit qui a fait joie en 1901. Ça veut dire que Tiyom lui-même te fait durant les années 1800 combien Donc, so, Yom qui fait en 1800 combien, petit lui mourit en 2000 combien Est-ce que vous avez compris ça Ça veut dire que c'est son pile année que petit ça a été fait sur la terre. Mont, euh, Malin l'a fait. Et si vous demandez la, la graisse, il te relève la graisse. Si vous demandez qui est-ce je vois ce qui est comme c'est vrai parce que je vois ce qui est pas même seulement comme on dit que tu y obtiens mené la gouna, il t'aimait mené Iram, Sidwan, il t'aimait mené les lames Sidwan ou est Boulot, nous est Boulot, nous est Sidwan, nous est Oda. Ce n'est pas nécessairement pour 
que nous là, nous avons l'autre seulement pour nous manger ensemble. Mais c'est pour nous capables de créer une atmosphère côté que non seulement petit, nous sommes capables de faire l'autre, mais nous sommes capables de connaître la connexion familiale pour que les amis puissent aller pour nous capables de nous reconnecter dans 20, 30, 50 ans encore. Ça veut dire, même si nos équipes ne sont pas là encore, ça sont des familles qui sont capables de mettre en collection de famille pour dans 50 ans encore. Tout le monde qui a connu l'autre, qui a habité en France, habité en Haïti et le pays, les États-Unis, etc. Donc, so, c'est pour vous dire à la majorité de familles, petites, petites, yo, yo, à vivre à l'étranger, mais surtout aux États-Unis. Mais, il y a qui a vécu, toujours, en plus, nous toujours vécu en Haïti. En fait, jusqu'à présent, nous avons vécu en Haïti. Nous avons tout vécu en Haïti. Donc, nous faut que nous de toute façon, débat. So, l'objectif là, c'est pour nous capables de parler ensemble, faire connexion, où est le monde que nous pas nous longtemps, où est le petit monde qui fait connaissance avec cousins, cousines, etc. Pour que les gens ne se pas à connaître ça, c'est pour moi, ça c'est pour les cousins. Et puis, pour connexion, nous avons été pour des années encore. Je vais vous donner un petit peu de Rast Joseph là. Pour ne pas bien quitter une fois et deux, relaisser tout le monde qui est là. C'est vrai qu'un petit peu de temps qui est là, malheureusement, je ne suis pas là, c'est vraiment avec le temps. Mais, je vais vous donner tout ça en partie. Je vais vous donner un petit peu de place à Pasteur Arnel pour que l'État dise Pasteur Arnel, vous ne pouvez pas vous donner un petit peu de place. Des fois, vous ne pouvez pas vous donner un petit peu de place. Des fois, vous ne pouvez pas vous donner un pas pour le bon. Alright, so, thank you very much everybody for listening. So, now we take connecting. That's the keyword. Yes, 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 yes. Well, uh, I'm going to speak English because we have a diverse community here. Everyone here speaks English. A lot more speaking English right now. And we have a few of you speaking Creole. But my goal here is to make sure that we allow each and every one to hear what needs to be said. I want to let you know, okay, that uh, I have the names, okay? I have the names of almost, I want to say maybe 500 people in the family tree, all right? I was able to collect it. I have it on an Excel spreadsheet. And what I want to do is I would like to be able to get the names of the young men and women here that have children that is not recorded because I have a lot of names dating back from the 1800s. They say it couldn't be done, but I think I got it done. I think I got it done, okay? I talked to everybody. I talked to a lot of people in the family to find out about Joseph, Joseph, Joseph. And I know I can say some names some people here don't even know, okay? Uh, I, I, um, I was born here in America, and you know, all my life, I always wanted to be able to understand my mother and my father's background. All I heard was about Haitian this, Haitian that, in a negative sense. But my goal was always to make it positive. Okay? I always fought the negative. Always fought the negative physically and mentally. I know you all have gone through it. But for the young men and women here, we want you to be proud of who you are, where you come from, and learn to expand it as far as it needs to go. Okay? Because in every six generations, we lose the name. It only takes six generations to lose your name. So I would like everyone here to make it their priority to maintain the Joseph legacy. Amen. All right, all right. Are y'all hearing me? Y'all hearing me? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and do this, okay? I wanted to let everyone know what my plan was. My plan for the Joseph family was to have a family reunion in Miami. I've already did it one time. This is the second time we've had a family reunion. The next goal that I wanted to do is have it in West Palm Beach. And then in Orlando. And then go on a cruise. And after the cruise, go to Haiti. Anybody feel excited to do anything like that? So that means we have a lot of work to do. We have a lot of work to do. So I want everybody to be motivated because this is the beginning of the motivation so that we can see from 
the far past of the people that got on boats and took a dreadful uh, route into Florida waters that died on the open seas. I want to make sure that everyone understands that we value all of those that died for, for us to be here in America to enjoy what we consider the American freedom, liberty. Okay, we're enjoying it. And our goal is to maintain it. I don't want to talk anymore, but I want everyone to give a round of applause. A round of applause. Have your hands. Let's go. A round of applause. A round of applause. Come on, little kids. I know you're out there. Give a round of applause for, for our master of ceremony, the host of the evening, Success Junior.
on three. Team Joe, if you guys are happy to be here, happy to be alive, happy to family, on three makes the noise. One, two, three, Team Joe! <laughs> uh. <laughs> All right, Team Seth. Except for everybody in the line. That's not fair, because some of y'all are trying to sides. Team Seth, if you are happy to be here, happy to be alive, happy for family, all three men.
Thank you. I didn't realize. Ladies and gentlemen, one more time for Jane and You guys need to clap a little louder for her because I just found out she came all the way from Minnesota. So ladies and gentlemen, one more time for Jane and Minnesota. I feel
boys trying to win that one.
gonna take turns to see which side tapped out first with the bibles. Okay? So Team Joe. How this game works is there's two sides. I will be asking one side at a time for a Bible. The first side that cannot give me a Bible. Are the losers? Well, they don't win. Really. Don't want the losers. You just didn't win this. Alright? Now, the Haitian Americans, I see you guys are a little confused. So, we're going to take this one out. We're going to take this one out. Yeah. 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 Haitian Americans, like, what's the power? Playing a lottery? No. Team Joe, who on this side when we start off? Chef Julius. Chef Julius. First of all, Okay, just one. Okay? Uh, not before they took Hold on, hold on, hold on, man, hold on. Basically. There's no Bible. There's no Bible. One Bible, hold on. Heat there. I said heat there. Has one for us.
Lorsqu'il fut majeur, Joseph quitta la maison et s'établit de manière permanente sur l'île. À cette époque, la beauté de l'île de la Gonave n'était qu'une toile vac vacante, vierge mais fertile. C'est pourquoi l'île elle-même a attiré de nombreux habitants des villes du sud d'Haïti. L'île de la Gonave, l'île au large d'Haïti, était largement connue pour ses vastes plantes pleines luxuriantes, ses montagnes et ses contourniers, contourniers à soi. Une fois que Joseph a décidé de s'installer à la Gonave, il s'est rendu dans une région connue sous le nom de Plaine Mapou, qui est devenue par la suite le lieu de naissance de notre famille Joseph. La Plaine de Mapou est située dans la troisième tronçon de grande source, connue de l'Ansagalais. C'est un très vaste plateau entouré de deux collines qui agissent comme une ceinture protectrice. Un de ces collines s'appelle Morne. La pierre, dont la hauteur est de 710 mètres de haut. La région est connue pour son rouge sol argileux, comme son nom l'indique. On y trouve des mapous géants et d'autres grands arbres qui poussent et protègent le sol de leur L'origine unique de notre famille, l'origine unique de nom, de notre nom de famille, Joseph, vient du changement de nom de Joseph, petit homme. Premier enfant avec Sanorine Sanon Morisset, surnommé Ron Aya. Il avait dix enfants réunis et il reçut tous les nouveaux noms de famille Joseph. Comme signature au lieu de petit homme, c'est ainsi que le nom de famille Joseph est désormais Continuant à déployer ses ailes dans les nombreuses branches de Joseph, ici aux États-Unis et à l'étranger. Je tiens à remercier sincèrement le cousin Luxama Toussaint pour ses recherches, approfondies et son énorme et dévouement pour élaborer un, doux, un document d'une telle importance historique, apportant clarté et compréhension à notre génération aujourd'hui et demain. Il s'agit d'une version condensée de l'ouvrage qui vous a été lu ce soir. Si vous êtes intéressé à obtenir une copie de ce document, en français ou en anglais, veuillez contacter mon cousin Sharon Joseph. C'était tout pour ce soir. Merci et le programme continue. On salue Lixama pour son bon travail. Merci la famille Joseph. Je remets à Sharon. Alors. Euh, J'espère maintenant que vous êtes au courant de votre racine où vous venez et tout. Euh, en, en effet, c'est un gros, c'est un gros sac. Euh, ouais, mais c'est chiant. Hein. On a une belle famille, la famille Joseph. Merci. Ah, that's awesome. Thank you, Betty Joseph. Ok, vous avez demandé pour moi qui n'a pas de bien pour vous camper. Combien de petits mouns ou combien de mouns qui te fait avec Papa Yossi Etienne, Joseph? Est-ce que vous avez. Lève vos mains ou stand up? Tout petit Etienne, côté Yoé. 1, 2, 3, 4. Ok, faites camper. All right, all right. Did everybody see them? Everybody see them? Come and see what you are saying, Come Papa, say, No, no, no. Okay. One more. There you go. Hello, everybody. What we heard earlier was our family's history in French. I will be reciting the same thing but in English for our English speakers. So hello, good evening everyone. My name is Celine Jose. I am the daughter of Willem Jose and the granddaughter of 
Benita Jose, who is the firstborn child of Eloise Joseph, best known as Tino. Around the 1800s, our journey begins in Morna Bato, commune of Gressier, a district of Port-au-Prince within the western region of Haiti. St. Louis Petit Homme and others was Sophie Etienne. She gave birth to two children in St. Louis Petit Homme named Joseph Petit Homme and Angelina Petit Homme. Joseph Petit Homme grew up and lived in Morna Bato during his youth. At the beginning of the 1900s, after visits to the islands of Laguna, he grew fond of the island of Laguna. When he was of age, Joseph left home and established a permanent settlement on the island. At the time, the island of Laguna's beauty was a vacant canvas, virgin but fertile. This is why the island itself has attached many people from the southern cities of Haiti. The island of Laguna is the offshore island of Haiti, and it is widely known for its vast, luscious, luscious plains, mountains, and silk cotton trees. Once Joseph decided to settle in Laguna, he traveled to an area known as Plain de Mapo, which subsequently became the birthplace of our Joseph family. Plain de Mapo is located in the third section of Grand Source, commune of the Anse of Gatlin. It is very... <laughs> it is a very vast plateau, surrounded by two hills which look like a certain protected belt. One of these hills is located and called Mont La Pierre, whose height is 710 meters high. Plan de Mapo is around 300 meters above sea level. This area is known for its red clay soil. As its name suggests, there are Mapo giants and other large trees growing there and protecting the ground with their shade. The unique origin of our last name, Joseph, comes from Joseph Petit Homes renaming of his first set of children with Sanorin Sanan Maruset, nicknamed Gran Ana. They had ten children combined, and they all were given the new surname, Joseph, as their signature instead of Petit Homes. So we're all Petit Homes. This is how the Joseph's family's name was birthed in the island of Haiti, continuing to spread its wings to many branches of the Joseph's heir here in the United States and abroad. I would like to sincerely thank cousin Luxama Toussaint for his extensive research and his enormous dedication to crafting such a historical and important document providing clarity and understanding for both our today and tomorrow generations to carry forward. This is a condensed version of the body of work that we read to you tonight. If you are interested in having a copy of the real document in French or English, please contact my uncle, Sharon Jose. All right. I would like for everyone to, to fixate your eyes to the TV screen. It's up above. Keep your eyes up on the TV screen. All right, I hope everybody heard me. Please, fixate your eyes to the TV screen. All right, Will. No, you got to tell them what they're going to see. What? You got to tell them what they're going to see. Okay. Everyone, here's what we're going to do. We are going to go back. We're gonna go back into this old time capsule to see our lineage, where people came from, the hardships that they lived. And understanding that helps us see where we need to go. All right? And, as, and, as, and all in all, you're gonna hear from Luxama Toussaint, who is now in Haiti. He has allowed us and gave us a video recording of the location and the land that our family owns. Our family owns this large, large, pleasant land in Plain Mapu. A lot of land of our family and a lot of history is within this land. 
And I want to make sure that we go ahead and start. The start of the chosen. That's right. The start of the chosen. It's the beginning. 1700, 1800, 300, or 400 years of Joseph history. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, 
Maca. Só não ganhou o título lá, lá, o Bibi, o Messi. Ganhou, ganhou, foi bem, irmão. The next person we're gonna honor, he left. Oh, no, he did not. Pastor Abner. Hello, William! So here we go. Let me, let me, let me tell you something. Uh, for many of you guys, you guys understand the importance of a good man. You guys understand the importance of someone who's going to carry the mantle of the family. Let me tell you something. When God touched this man and told this man, you gonna serve me, that's what he decided to do. He said, you gonna follow me. I'm gonna take you, but I need you, sir. And go save people. Bring people to God. If everybody knew, I wish you guys could see the video. Our family did not start off in, in, in the word or in the gospel of Jesus Christ. They did a lot of other things. In contrary to the, to the glory of God. Ain't that right, Papa? So let me tell you something. We got somebody who is who was brave enough in the family to stand in the middle of the demons and the devils and said, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, praise the Lord. He was willing to go in, put his hand in the fire and said, I'm going to take you out and I'm going to bring you to glory. Because we don't have too much more time. I want to go ahead and honor Pastor Alvin Joseph. For, no, no, let's clap up now. Because it ain't not too many Josephs that was willing to be a, a preacher. That was willing to deliver the word. He said, I would do it. Amen. So we're going to honor Pastor Alvin Joseph. With a plaque, a small token of your of your signature in the family. God bless you.
Let me tell you why I say them for last. I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you the significance of, of them in, in here. They are riding around the corner. Honor 
with me. Come to this table and take a picture with you. Because let me tell you something. If you don't know where you come from, you don't know where you're going. They come from this table right here. They come from this table right here that created all of this to happen today. Young people, come visit our people. Because let me tell you something, you don't got that much long to go. And we were just talking about we're the first generation. We're the first generation of Americans. They're going to build. They're going to live. Guys, so we are. Listen. Honor them. You got it? Honor them. We're going to go ahead and have a toast right now. Now he's ready to But let me tell you, we're going to go ahead and have a toast. A toast. We don't have too much time. When I say we don't have too much time, we got less than 30 minutes to go and we got to get out of here. Yes, man. Yes, man. Yes, man. We're going to go ahead and have a toast. Listen. Come to this table and say, Thank you. Because some of you guys that turn up and got the business and the big house, y'all wouldn't have had it. But these people didn't decide that they were going to take this, this track in 1969, 1970. Wow. 71, 72, 73, 74, 1980. Yeah. 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 So here we go. Give me their blacks. They got their blacks. It was his birthday too. Can y'all please do me a favor? On the count of three, say this happy birthday. Happy birthday. birthday. One, two, three. Let me tell you something. 